welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Rabiana. So today I have a synthetic wig review for you guys and I know a lot of people have been waiting for this because back when I started my YouTube channel like around a year ago, these were very popular on my channel and I think that's where most of my subscribers even came from. So I decided to bring back synthetic wigs on my YouTube channel. And yeah, so I know a lot of you guys are excited, especially if you have been subscribed to me since like forever ago, like a year ago, then um, you guys probably are excited as well. So let's go ahead and jump into this synthetic wear review. Okay, so I first wanna start with the stock card. So this is a stock card right here. And the wig that I have today is a model model wig unit and it's the seven star v shape lace front series type of thing that they have going on so the style that i have is ev003 and the color that i have is om 43 op and i will leave that all right here so that you guys could um see that and also in the inside of this brochure type of thing they have washing instructions so you can wash this wig if you want to i did not do that and then also they tell you that it's safe safe to curl up to 400 degrees which i did not put heat up to my synthetic wigs because that's just something that i don't do um i don't have, i just don't have time to be melting hair so also it tells you all the um colors that this wig unit comes in and here is like this cinnamon rusty looking orange color that they have going on i don't think i like that um, and then also a few different other colors back here, which is like honey blonde. You have like a platinum bar blonde with like um, roots, dark roots. And then I also see like purple here and then also like a burgundy reddish type of tones also. And then they also tell like all the other colors that are in the inside. And that's pretty much it with the stock, stock card. Um, I think it's pretty helpful. Basic information about washing the hair and about the wig unit and all okay so when it comes to the packaging it came in this um really big packaging um very sturdy and it also came with this little bag right here which the box came in and it was also like very secure it had stuffing in it it had a net over it and all type of stuff so if you guys were worrying about the packaging the packaging is good hands down let's go ahead and talk about this color and this wig itself so I love the color on this wig. It's a dark root, so I don't want to say it's jet black, maybe like a 1B. And then it comes down to this ombre that's like a brown color, but it also has a little bit of highlights in it as well. This wig unit is about 24 inches. It does not tell you on the box, but I was just trying to like freehand it. Like, I don't know, it seems like it's 24 inches. But it does have layers in it right here in the front area and like at the top. And I love layered hair. It frames my face better. I don't really like flat hair. It just doesn't look that good on me. I'm not really a fan of flat hair. So I love the volume that this hair gives and also the layers. Um, and the layers are about like 18 inches. Then it goes all the way down to like 24 inches. So I also want to get into the texture of this hair because I know that a lot of people are into like the texture. So this texture feels like one of those thick yakky textures and it also has crinkles in it. And I just want to let you guys know, know that because I know there's a lot of people that doesn't like crinkles. So I want to come up so you guys could see. Um, hopefully you guys could see like the actual texture of this hair and the crinkles in it, but I, it does have crinkles just in case you guys don't, um, see that. Also, I want to talk about like the lace and everything. I did cut the lace off. Um, it's not lace off throughout this unit. It's only like in the parting area. So you can't really part it anywhere except for like this, but you can like shift it and move it however you like. Um, I just feel like this wig unit is only supposed to be worn in the middle because the way that these layers are. So if you guys were wanting to like shift it, I don't really think that that would work out for you guys. Um, I wanna talk about the construction of this wig. It does come with two combs on the side and then one in the bag and it also comes with adjustable straps. Now under my wig, I do have my natural hair. So that's why I decided to go ahead and put these synthetic wig reviews out. Um, so I can wear like my natural hair um, like on the edges and stuff like that because that's the only time that I'm able to um, Because if it's braided now, I can't really finesse my baby hairs and stuff like that because I wear frontals all the time This comes with three combs and adjustable straps and I do feel like the combs are in like weird spots like 
they're on the side, but I feel like they're they only like right here. Like the combs are like right here. So it's like you have to stretch this wig out so that it can come far down enough. I just feel like the combs are in weird spots. That's it. <laughs> I don't know how to explain that any more than the combs are in uh, the wrong spot. Seriously. The shedding can leave and the tangling is okay. It's not that bad. Um, tangling, but the shedding, I don't like the shedding. It's, it sheds a little too much, but I don't wear these synthetic wigs at all. Like... Like I wear them for just the videos because these stock cards can make wigs look so bad online. So that's why I like to come and do synthetic wig reviews for you guys to show you guys what it actually looks like on a person's head. Because I'm telling you, I honestly, I don't think I would have bought this. Like, I don't think I would have bought this <laughs> really. But it's not a bad wig at all. I think it lays pretty flat. And again, I have natural, natural thick hair. And I just split my hair down the middle and like put my hair into like this ball back here. So there is like a huge ball back here, but you can't even tell because this hair is like super thick. And I think that's like another good thing for this wig unit as well. I think that this wig unit is super cute, super cute for a beginner, somebody who loves color, somebody who doesn't want to spend a lot, a lot of money on a wig unit and just want to try out different things. I think that this is for you and especially because the color, I love the color. I don't think that it's doing too much. If you're a brown girl, this will look good on you. The color is really, really nice. Um, something you might not like is the texture, but I've already talked about that. So that's pretty much all I have to say. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on my social media at underscore Rayviana Simone and Rayviana on Snapchat. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!